<laughs> That's a thumbnail right there, baby. Enough said. Oh! <laughs> What's going on boys? It's your boy Plasmark Reacts back with another reaction. Today we are going to be reacting to the Demon Slayer Swordsmith Village Arc Season 3 finale. Um, and it is a hefty one. We got a big old 52 minute finale here. Um, I thought I saw it was supposed to be 70 minutes, but I guess that was probably with ads when it, when it aired on TV in Japan. But um, yeah, we got a whopping big old 52 minute episode we got here so just about two episodes length of usual uh that we're going to be doing to round out the season and kind of send us into whatever we have next uh i expect i usually from the last episode the last couple seasons i didn't expect a fight this one i do expect a fight uh at least a like some sort of animated finale um that also probably has um the fourths backstory in it we got a tease of it last episode i wonder if we're gonna get a full thing um but it's very similar to one piece of rochi uh from what i could tell from the little section we got um and i'm assuming that i'm going to hate uh the fourth even more i believe his name is hangetsu um but i'm not 100 percent on that but yeah very uh very excited to get into this finale i'm a big fan of demon slayer uh always have been so if you guys are new to the channel and you haven't seen the previous reactions to demon slayer season three make sure to go check them out like subscribe let's try and get this demon slayer reaction to 20 likes um and yeah uh, i'm super excited to get in i can't wait any further so without further ado let's hop straight into the shit oh what the hell what the hell hold on yeah, then Ginyu fucking chucks a whole ass tree. Yo, wait. Wait a minute, bro. Hold on. You didn't even see that, though, Tanjiro. You didn't even see that, Tanjiro. But whatever. I'm sure he's thinking of other things that fucking demons have done. How diabolical when you're the one who's killed dozens of people. Hundreds, probably. My man! My man! My other man! Reach out my boy, bro. Everyone in the Hashira. So far. Yes, sir, Genya. We lift in this bitch. But we will never give up. Let's go. No intro. Let's get right into this shit, boys. Let's go. The connected bonds. Daybreak and first light. We shot two trees? Kenya's lifting! Alright, Nezuko. Pin him down. We're tons there, How are you guys get ahead of him? There you go. Yep. It's gotta be quick. Oh. Is he gonna thunder breathe? No way! No way! No way, Sanji, you're gonna thunder breathe, bro. Our boy's in it, too. Showing up. He's gonna thunder breathe! Oh my god! Oh my! 
Да. Yes! What? Dude, he thunder breathed. Oh my god. Dude, he does he's the master of all breathing. Come on. What? Somebody save him! Kenya! Oh! Yes, sir, Kenya! All your logics are suck? I'm assuming it's gonna be all your logics suck, you shithead. Come on, Kenya! Oh, no. Let's go! Yes, sir, Genya. Ripped both his arms off? Yes, sir, my man. Jesus Christ. Come on, Tanjiro. Oh, no. Oh, his eyes are back. He's at a demon. Oh no. Oh. <laughs> he feels fear. No. No, this is horrible. This is horrible. This is terrible. Lightning breathe again, Tanjiro. <laughs> Cause you can just fucking first time it. Yep. One more time. Lightning breathe. Is that it? Is that the sword? It's Moichiro! Yes, sir! You have to use it! This is your new blade, Tanjiro. Lightning step again! Here we go! It's time! It's time, baby! Yes, sir! The 300 year old blade! <laughs> That's a thumbnail right there, baby. Enough said. Oh! <laughs> Wait, is that Ray Goku? Is that his ninth form? Oh! <laughs> he took off like it was fucking ninth form. <laughs> yes, sir. We cut those. We cut those. Dancing Flash. Holy shit, bro. And that's gotta be it. I mean, the other fucking Mitsuru's gotta have it easy now. Don't let your guard down. Oh, Dawn. Never mind. You have to see if Mitsuri's arrive. Oh, Nezuko! Oh shit, bro. Mitsuri? Mitsuri has to save her, bro. What? She's... She's reaching out to somebody else. He's still up. He's still fucking up. What's the main body then? Oh! 
I mean, the, the other, he's gonna die too. You gotta help her. Even if it's the wrong one, his fucking half body's gonna get shit on anyways. I never thought this would ever be a problem for us, to be honest. I, I don't know how I never... Genius too weak. Mitra's out. Somebody's gotta show up, bro. Either Mitri's gotta be done with the other one or, or he's gotta show up. But if if the big if the, the main body isn't dead, then Mitri's still fighting. You have to run. Someone's gotta help. Someone f Someone's gonna show up, come on! No way, Nesco pushes him away. Nesco's actually gonna fucking die. Oh my god, dude. I never thought this was gonna happen. Oh my fucking god, dude. Bro. Dude, Nezuko's actually gonna fucking die. What? Oh my fucking god, dude. I just never thought it was gonna happen. I honestly thought they were gonna make it to the end. There's no way. This is bait. This has gotta be bait. It's bait. It's bait. I don't believe it. There's no fucking way Nezuko dies. It's bait. It's fucking bait. Stop baiting me, you photobull. Stop baiting me, Demon Slayer. Get the hell out of here. Couple seconds from here. Nezuko died! And fucking Zenitsu's gonna slip in and save her, bro. I bet. I bet. No way. No way. No way. No way. There's no fucking way, dude. No way, no way, no way, no way, no, no, not, mm mm. I mean, this song. OSC this season has been insane, and he's gonna go right for it because that's what she wants. Where's the small one? This is looking beautiful as shit, bro. Dude, this OST. <laughs> I thought it was gonna get flames. That's the opening line. Inside the heart. Yes, sir, Tanjiro! Yes, so oh, <laughs> that fucking face, bro. Yes. Don't even let him burn. Don't even let him burn. Cut him before it. Yes, sir. Oh, here's the fucking backstory. Doesn't matter how sad your backstory is. Yeah, because you're about to fucking die! Come on, Tanjiro. Before he can burn. Doesn't matter. It doesn't even matter. Look at him! Look at him! Yes, sir! And now you burn. That was nice. Short and sweet backstory. Don't give a shit. He's an asshole. Doesn't matter how much time we have left. Half the fucking episode. Holy shit. Okay, there's no way Nezuko's dead. There's no way.
There's no one. You wanna know why? Because my boy Zenitsu has to bag her, bro. If there, if she, if he doesn't, then it's over. It's all finished, bro. I mean, she's walking to you right now, bud. Just turn around. How? How? What? What? What happened? Was she still a demon, I think, because I see the claws? <gasps> we finally get to hear her talk! Good morning. Oh my god! We're finally gonna have a female in the fucking team that talks. Oh my god. I cannot wait to see interactions between Nezuko and Zenitsu, bro. It is gonna be the funniest fucking thing imaginable. How can she do this? How? Okay, you didn't forget how to talk. You just... Haven't talked for a while. Come on. You're still 14 years old. You know how to talk. Your voice would just be raspy, but it's fine. That's how they're portraying it. I want to know how this is happening, though. Like, I need an explanation this ep episode, or else I'm going to fucking lose it. You don't even realize it. Your little, your, your little brother, your big brother, is literally the goat. Like, he is the goat of all time in this anime. Not in every anime. Like, don't even get me started. But, as far as fucking Demon Slayer goes, Tanjiro is the GOAT, alright? Besides, if this man was still alive, he wouldn't be, but... How, bro? Do you see it? What happened, Genya? Bro, Genya smiled! My heart! It's melting! Genya smiled! Honestly, he's not as rough as <laughs> fucking Entertainment District still. He was like... <laughs> he is not as rough as then. Alright, how are we going to resolve this season then? How's Mitsuri doing? She's still fighting? <laughs> okay, this has got to be before he got cut because he would have died. Oh. Bye bye, buddy. Bye bye. Bye bye. See you later. Fucking loser. Bye bye. That's because Tanjiro's the GOAT. He's the GOAT. <laughs> Hold on. She's about to get fucking passed out in two seconds. Or are going to cut to where they're all back resting? Toshi Kuni. Oh, is that the fucking boss? Oh, this is Muzon. He's gonna kill the whole family. He's gonna kill the whole family. What? What? <laughs> I knew it. Jesus Christ. <laughs> Michael Jackson. Moves on backstory. Right now? Dude, I can't believe we're getting moves on backstory. Yup. Damn.
So medicine created the demons? Some kind of mix between things? Jesus Christ, dude. Jesus Christ, dude. Oh my god. Muzan. Jesus Christ. The power of eternity. So how did Nezuko overcome the sun is the question. I mean, if if he if Muzan was smart, he would just go after right now. There's Muichiro. I mean, they're like distant cousins, no? Or like. Now here comes the, yep. <laughs> she said it. Here comes Mitsuri. <laughs> How are you not out of gas yet? Oh. Damn, Genya is immediately a tomato, bro. Immediately a tomato. Dude, this is actually such a fat dub. I don't even know how it happened, and I want to know right fucking now. If they don't explain this by the end of the episode, I'm going to be a little mad. But at the same time, this opens up so many more dialogue possibilities than Nezuko just grunting, you know? Like, oh my gosh. She can talk again. Oh, back to her, bro. It's been like nine years. What the hell? Is she more human than demon now? Dude, now that we're back here, I feel like Muzan's just gonna appear and just start fucking ripping and tearing. There you go. So how about the sword? Where's the sword? Oh, there's the sword. <laughs> Dude, I want to see it now! Oh, he's dead. He's gonna die. He's gonna die. Yep, he's gonna die. Here you are. Deserved it. Heroes, farewell. Yes, sir. Alright, I think that's going to wrap it up. Alright, let's see if there's an after credit scene real quick, though. Perhaps... There might be time. There might not be. Nope. Just as go in the daylight. All right. So that is the end of the Swordsmith Village arc. Um. Really, really cool ending. Um. I really want to know exactly how Nezuko is able 
to live in the sunlight. But I assume, like, uh, I forgot what her name is, she said that, like, she's her cells are changing. So I'm assuming she is now more human than demon, and that is how she can stay in the sunlight. And for some reason, her nature, her mindset, or whatever she said, was prioritizing her protection, so she felt like she had to be strong. So maybe she was feeling like she had to be more demon so she could protect Tanjiro. Maybe they'll explain it more in the future. I'm not exactly sure. Um, but definitely a cool season finale to Demon Slayer this season. Do I think it was better than last season? Absolutely not. But it was a really cool season nonetheless. Um, definitely didn't feel like filler the entire time. Like, it wasn't filler. It was a good fucking season. Um, I definitely... I like uh, Muichiro and I like uh, Mitsuri, but they're not as cool as Tangan and they're not as cool as my boy. So I'm excited to see some of the other Hashira or maybe some more of the interactions. If, you know, maybe um, Mitsuri or Muichiro is going to stay with the group, you know, like maybe the next season will be more of them. You know, that would be kind of cool too. Instead of just being like, bye, see ya, maybe never again in the show or like, you know, uh, who fucking knows. But. Because that's what Tangan's like, and obviously Rengoku died. So, um, so you know, maybe these these uh, Hashira will stay around, and that would be kind of cool to see interaction between them in the future. Like I said, Nezuko being able to live in the sunlight and not having to have the thing on, um, well, maybe she does in the future, I don't really know, is going to open up a lot more, like, interactions between the group. And I hope that it stays like that, and they don't just go back to it being, like, a plot convenience that Nezuko stayed alive and she overcame the sun just in that moment, and she can't do it anymore. Like, that would be stupid. I hope that she doesn't have to have the thing any on anymore, and she can interact with the group uh, back when they're together, which I'm assuming that will be next season, but who knows. Um, where she can interact with more people than just grunting, you know? Like, that. that's going to open up so many more possibilities for dialogue uh, and character development for Nezuko, um, which would be really cool. And I can't wait to see the interaction between her and Tanjiro now that she can talk, you know? Like, we saw a glimpse of it there, but I hope, like, we can see, like, you know... These, these smaller moments that they have where Nezuko is just a cute child, you know, I hope she can have those interactions with her brother while dialogue can happen. Like, I hope we can see more of that, you know? Um, but yeah, really cool fucking, um, really cool season. Uh, finale looked, looked awesome. A lot of cool shots of Tanjiro there. Awesome. I have to say the best episode is probably the one with uh, Mitsuri. Or the one where, where Tanjiro killed all four demons at once, or three demons at once with the fucking flaming sword. Best episode of the season was one of those two. Um, for fucking sure. Uh, but yeah, really cool season. Uh, I, I still think they butchered my boy Marichiro. I think he, he got shafted on his fight. I think his fight could have gone so much harder than it did. But um, at the end of the day, it was still a good season. And I hope that the seasons we get in the future um, evolve on what we got this season. And I cannot wait for my boy, Genya's brother, Sanami. I hope to God he goes fucking crazy because he has always been, like from the, the glimpses we've seen, the Hashira I have the most fucking excitement for. Now, would I have had more, more excitement if my boy... Rengoku lived, obviously, because he is the fucking goat of all time. But, since he is gone, I am super excited to see Sanami, and I hope we get him as soon as possible. We don't have very many options left in terms of Hashira. We have Obanai, um, with the snake, which I'm assuming he will get some dialogue maybe next season as well. Um, we already saw a little bit of Shinobu, but I'm sure we'll go back. Uh, and then we have Gyu, uh, which we've had interaction with you too, uh, but I'm assuming he'll be kind of like, uh, you know, an equal to Tanjiro now that Tanjiro is so fucking strong. Um, and then we have um, Gyome, and Gyome is a mystery to me, bro, um, because he just cries every time, and it doesn't even look like he wields, wields a fucking sword. So I don't even know how Gyome is going to be, but we only have like four Hashira left, and I cannot wait to see what each of them brings to the table. But my most excited is my boy Sanami. And now that Genya is wholesome on our side, he's smiling like a fuck, he's one of the crew. Genya the GOAT, bro. Not the GOAT.
But he's he's my man. He is my man, bro. He just lifts. He's a Giga Chad Genya, bro. That's the one thing I learned this season. Is that Genya, I was like, oh, this guy's kind of cool, I guess. But now, he just eats demons and Giga Chad throws trees. Like, what else do we need? Anyways, that's going to wrap up the season of Demon Slayer Season 3 on the channel reactions. Uh, like and subscribe if you are new to the channel. I will be doing all of Demon Slayer, whether I get 10 views on a video to 100. Um, so like and subscribe if you're enjoying the Demon Slayer on the channel. And I will react to the first trailer as soon as we get more information on Season 4, which is fucking inevitable. Uh, because it's fucking Demon Slayer. Um, but yeah, like and subscribe. Let's try and get the 20 likes on this video, like I said in the beginning. And if you are new to the channel, we're trying to get to 1,000 subscribers by the end of the year. So subscribe, uh, and I will do a shirtless, not shirtless, a made outfit reaction if we get to 1,000 subscribers before the end of the year. Um, to probably several, several different things. I keep saying it's probably going to be the end of the Wano arc for One Piece. But I'll probably do several different things depending on what's airing at the time. Um, or, or what you guys want to see perhaps. So, but yeah, like and comment down below if you want to watch me, see me react to something else. Now that Demon Slayer is over, Black Clover is happening, guys. It is happening. It is starting. I only have 13 episodes in the movie, which I heard the movie was fucking fire. Have not seen anything post time skip, and I have now made it to time skip. Um, all I had to do was watch filler. I already watched all of the uh, Elf Invasion arc, unfortunately. That would have been fire to react to on the channel, but I reacted that while it was airing. Uh, not re reacted. I watched that while it was airing. But, Demo but I will say it now. Black Clover is going to be taking over the Demon Slayer spot for the next couple weeks until summer anime starts airing. After I finish Black Clover, Bleach will start. Alright, this is an announcement video as well. Bleach is going to happen, guys, and I have not watched any of Thousand Year Blood arc, and I'm in the middle of Waco Mundo. So, I cannot wait to get into some Bleach, because I saw a snippet of what Thousand Year Blood War arc looks like, and holy fucking shit, and we only have, we still have three parts left, and that's airing in summer too. So, this is happening, Demon Slayer is done, but we got Nishuko Tensei coming up, we got Bleach coming up, we got uh, Black Clover coming up, we got a whole bunch of shit. So, stay tuned on the channel, like and subscribe if you're new, and I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace out.